move to the story now. The brother of a man who was killed during student protests in Bramfontein last year says he's shocked that the justice system has freed the men accused of his murder. Ntoko Zisi Ntumba was shot with rubber bullets as he left a doctor's office in uh, the CBD in Johannesburg. The police officers who were monitoring a student protest at the time have been acquitted. The court found there wasn't enough evidence to convict them. Slindina Masikani reports. Morning. Students with students are... It's the 10th of March 2021. Like every other year, students are on the streets protesting against financial exclusion and the exorbitant fees of accessing tertiary education. But this time, things took a turn for the worst. A man lost his life. At the time, it wasn't clear if he was a bystander or a student. It was later revealed that Mtogo Zisintumba was a husband, a father of three, and a public servant. More than a year later, four police officers who were on trial for Ndumba's murder have been acquitted. These proceedings, there is no direct evidence in the form of eyewitness or witnesses. I mean to say that there is no person to say he or she saw the accused persons or any of them committing the offences in question. The defence says this is a victory for the rule of law. Justice has prevailed. That's the long and short of it. This is just a confirmation of the long-standing legal principles. Justice has been reinforced. Justice has prevailed today. The law has taken its course. One of the officers says this means he can finally move on with his life. Just imagine they're saying you've murdered somebody, been called a murder. It's not an easy thing. And as a police officer, I've never done that. It was the first time that happened, yes. But in, for my family, at least it should be a relief now for them. But for Ndumba's family, they've been left with more questions. So like, I'm shocked. Because if the NPA has accepted the ruling. We will uh, then study the judgment to, t to determine if there is a need to take um, the judgment on review. While these officers are now free to go, the question remains, who killed Mtogozi Sintumba? Slinda Lomasigan, Johannesburg.